I don't want to. I mean, you seem like you're in good spirits. This was your your, your first bit of adversity today. You guys faced. Just what what do you think? What happens? Where do you go from here? Man, you can only look at the bad and go up from here, and uh, that's what we plan to do tomorrow when we come in and look at the film. So I'm looking to go look at the film on the plane, and then tomorrow as a team. So that's the only thing we can do right now. No, uh, I just know that we just got to come out with better energy uh, to start with. Uh, I think I had the, the long run, but we just capitalized off of little things like that uh, to go out and keep the energy going. Tomo mentioned the same thing about the third quarter coming out with better energy. Mm -hmm. How do you do that? Is it something that you guys have to keep yourselves going in the locker room? Is it something that the coaches have to keep you going for? Like, How, how do you improve that? Uh, just all around the whole team. Uh, Offense especially, uh, we just got to come out with a better attitude and uh, just know like we coming out because we de defer, so we got to come out with better energy just to know that we going down and trying to score uh, coming out to half. Um, that's the only thing, like energy, you can't make anybody have energy, but at the end of the day, you could, as a player with yourself, you know, like going into the third quarter, you know we're going to have the ball coming out. You just got to know that we got we going down and try to score. A lot of people are probably going to remember that early play you had where you got hit and it looked for sure like you were down and then mm -hmm. somehow managed to keep your balance. Can you describe that one? It hurt. That's all I can tell you. Uh, I know I kept my balance, but that's like a hard hit. So uh, I attribute that to great balance and God <laughs> just helping me just stay up on that one. So, but it did hurt. Yeah, that, that hurt. What, is allowed, what do you think has allowed you and, and Sam to have the connection y'all have had so far? Through the first four games? To practice. Uh, just knowing that he uh, can trust me to be where I'm going to be uh, within the uh, passing concepts that we have. It's just uh, building trust uh, day in and day out. Is there anything y'all did to build trust other than just the regular practice? I don't know. Uh, that's just timing and uh, everything that goes with it uh, through everything. Just understanding the playbook, uh, just knowing that. Uh, the progression of just being out there, being a receiver, but being a quarterback at the same time, just knowing where you are in the progression and where he's going to be looking and stuff like that. DJ, do you feel a certain responsibility when Christian's not out there to, to make plays like that when you were talking about earlier? I mean, is that consciously in your mind? Uh, no, it's not consciously in my mind. We know, we all know that 22 wasn't out there today, so everybody had to step up and uh, just be who they are, but take it to the next level. What did the team learn about itself today? What'd you say? What did the team learn about itself today? To when adversity hit, that we just got to fight back even harder. That's the main thing I took from today.